Yerdy McYert Yert. <laughs> what the fuck is the word, man? Shout out to my man's black, you heard? We're gonna do some content too. I ain't gotta I ain't gotta talk too much. Feel me? This is a good nigga right here though. I don't like exciting things, you're not living life on the edge. So you might as well just fuck with whoever got the most red flags because they they gave you that like adrenaline rush. Because toxic women are exciting. You know the ones who always wanna see how you doing, wanna check back up. Those will be the best ones. You know why? Because it means no matter what, I'm still running circles in your mind. <laughs> you believe that? Oh, yeah. yeah, come on. Yo, ladies. Can we tighten up? <laughs> tighten up a little bit. Stand up. Actually, <laughs> do you have any female friends to let you know that you are doing bad? Because that was not the response to give. I'm going to keep it 100. <laughs> what? Like, what? These niggas, are, niggas is trying to spin the bleeds, trying to see what's really going on in between the knees. You are? Yeah, I'm just, I ain't trying to spill the game, fellas, but come on. That's that's poor Poon's management. I'm going to keep it 100 with you, man. That was a terrible response. What makes somebody your favorite ex? I don't believe in those. What you mean? Why Next not? question. Wow. I have no exes. They don't know me. I hate to I have no exes in Texas like I'm George State. Can we go to Georgia State when my two engine is handled by some random nigga that lives in Atlanta? I ain't gonna lie, that bought out. He was spitting. Say it, I hope I don't sound ridiculous. I don't know who this man Yo, Kiki is. Kiki Palmer is gorgeous. I mean, he could be walking down the street. I wouldn't, I wouldn't know a thing. Make somebody your favorite ex. I don't have a favorite ex, baby. But what would make somebody your favorite ex, though? There is nothing an ex can do for me to be my favorite. It is never that serious. If we're not together, we don't do nothing to each other. I ain't gonna lie. Certain, certain tricks he used to do, it made me want to be like voodoo. Like, I ain't gonna lie. I beg your pardon? Yo, y'all niggas getting too comfortable. V v what? Nigga, don't even speak that. Man, bur somebody burn some sage, get the evil eye cracking in here. Y'all niggas, what? Certain tricks make you, what the, what the voodoo? Y'all niggas bugging. That's too close to worshiping, you know what I'm saying? Satanic <laughs> rituals. You, <laughs> My man, stay away far away. We're, <laughs> we're normalizing pure fuckery, I tell you. Like, what the fuck? If if you feel like this is could be compared to that, <laughs> nigga, get away, man, please, for your safety. Especially if she Haitian. I ain't going, I ain't no disrespect to the Haitian women out there, I'm just saying. They might be responsible for some debauchery. <laughs> Y'all niggas, stop playing with them, man. They gon' f they a lot of women. You know what I'm saying? That niggas bugging out there. Sorry, sorry, tricks she used to do. First of all, you already had my man's black lost. I'm not even gonna lie. My son was debauch like. <laughs> it made me wanna be so like voodoo. Like I ain't gonna lie. Hmm? That's crazy. I know it sounds crazy though. Don't, Nigga, don't no. Look. It don't sound. It is. Don't look at it too much. It is, she, boy. She put a spell on me. That's all it is. What the fuck? Boo, what boo, the yo, boo, don't talk. Yo, put a hex on you. yo, this is why I don't let niggas touch. Certain people don't let them touch you, man. He's trying to pass that shit on to you, black. Get away from this nigga, man. He is not sane. What are we doing? Two, two, want to mess on you. Don't touch him, mate. Exactly. Don't touch the mate. Man, get this nigga out of here, man. You got voodoo on you, my brother. <laughs> this shit ain't got no voodoo on you. Yes, you do. You just said she did. Nigga ate the spaghetti. Gangster, he ate the spaghetti. Burn some sage out of here. He's bugging. He's gonna mark himself. What you doing? So, what makes somebody your favorite ex? They just have to be a favorite. How so? I can't really explain it. There's really no she favorite. She got a favorite. <laughs> I'm telling y'all right now, she got a favorite. She has a favorite. He calls. He might have called. He might have dropped her off here. Do you want better? He might be picking her up from there. She might get dropped off by one nigga, and that nigga might be coming over, or she might be going over there after the spot. Guarantee you, no bullshit. There's nobody I want to call right now when I'm drunk. Sorry. Well, you got my number now. So yeah. This motherfucker don't miss. No, he's fucking good. That motherfucker. Fucker, don't miss, man. He's good. Yo, so. Yo, black word. And you don't show that at the clip after. Gangster, yo. <laughs> hey, man. <laughs> you the favorite now, gang. 
<laughs> do what you will with that, y'all. My favorite X, right? What makes up my favorite uh -huh. is based on the amount of red flags and problems they brought to my life. You, you hear what you're saying out loud? Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. That should be your favorite. Never. But Absolutely I do not. favor the ones who brought the toxic. most excitement. Huh? That's toxic. How that's toxic? You said I bring the most red flags? Yeah. Because that's who bring the most excitement to your life. Because toxic women are exciting. They They're don't. toxic. Do you not like it? Nah, you got to like exciting things, bro. You can't. It, it's not toxic. You got to you gotta like exciting things, bro. If you don't like exciting things, you're not living life on the edge. So you might as well just fuck with whoever got the most red flags because they, they gave you that, like, adrenaline rush. Yo, you got to pay for the generation, y'all. Gen yeah, niggas is crashed out, man. I'm saying burnt out out there. The most exciting, that shit is giving me a headache. Actually, turn the generation is doomed. Like, I feel like in a healthy relationship and in a healthy breakup, you can still be friends with your ex. <laughs> hey, man, I, I'm not on that side, but you know what I'm saying? Everybody different. Salute to you. You got it. Wait, hold on. First of all, let's acknowledge. Let's acknowledge these beautiful, beautiful women right here. First and foremost, black. I don't know how you continue to step out here and do the things that you do but you're doing it at an amazing and alarming rate my man you know what i'm saying salute man salute you keep pulling up you keep showing up and you showing out man you keep putting them on camera man and i just hope that for research purposes only you got the instagrams uh not for no other purpose outside of research uh two men <clears throat> of the decade right here but look um yeah let's see what these beautiful queens got to say first and foremost y'all both look amazing Woo! I tell you, boy. It's the dick. Black women don't <laughs> seem to surprise me. Look at so it's the dick. It's the way they talk. It's the way they pull your hair when they smack it from the back. Wait, it's all of that. Hey, yo. Hey, yo. Nah, I ain't gonna lie, Black. I'm gonna keep it 100 with you, bro. You can't put that in here. I'm watching this, nigga. I, I, I was about to punch my screen. Like, what is he doing up there? Back to the beautiful young ladies, though. <laughs> she felt that in the background, too. What makes somebody your favorite ex? <laughs> My favorite ex? Yeah. My There's no such oh, thing I'm as a glazing. favorite ex. I'm glazing? Yo, comment below if I'm glazing. I hope I'm not... I mean, that's clip riding. That's not glazing. That's clip riding. I'm cool with that. Wait, hold on. Pause. Just in case. Just in case. Pause. Just in case. I don't, I don't know. The audio might sound... It might sound like some debauchery. And I'm not... I'm not with the buggery. I'm, I'm not right. Why? Because once I'm done with you, you die. Yeah, I'm a bad bitch. You can't kill me. Come this is bad to say, but the ones that those. like text back. Oh. What you mean? You know, the ones who always want to see how you doing, want to check back up. Stop. Stop. You know? Talk your shit, twin. Talk your okay. shit. Okay. Those be the best ones. Okay. You know why? Oh, my son got the VH. Because it means no matter what, Wait, oh, my son I'm got still the running circles tape. in your mind. Is that? Nigga. You I thought I knew that. Who that was in the got down. Fuck them all, nigga. I don't got one of those. No. I ain't gonna lie. If she a it. favorite ex, she can hit you right now and you gonna go and link her. Matter of fact, if she a favorite ex, it don't matter what y'all going through or what situation y'all in, you can still kill. Her. I ain't gonna lie. I'm unpopular opinion. I feel as though if you kill right, you can always kill. But that's just me. Not saying that's what I do. I'm saying that's just my thought process. And it could be wrong. I'm fine with being completely wrong. But in, in some instances, I feel like if you kill it good enough, well, how many ever times you have, you know what I'm saying? You can spin a block. I could be wrong, though. Spin the bottle, spin the bottle. What makes somebody my favorite ex? If he a good eater. Hey, yo! Nah, 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 nah. Yeah. Black, you you not about to get me, pause. Like, come on. <laughs> what we doing? Yo, the, the the editorial staff needs needs to be subpoenaed, my nigga. This is violation. Y'all niggas is violating. What y'all doing in there? In the studio bugging. <laughs> Yeah. You know, yeah. You know yeah. Throw me that. up in the air and all. Pull me a helicopter. It's over. Oh, you a helicopter? Get in a pool's eight while getting spun? 
Not crazy? That's hard because I ain't gonna lie, my favorite ex, she she know who she is. I don't wanna say names. I'm in a relationship with the love of my life and all that, you know what I'm saying? But she Y'all niggas gotta stop doing this shit, man. Y'all got to. Y'all got to. Stand up, brother. That was a bar, though. I'm gonna keep it 100. We gotta go back, cause that was. Names, I'm in a relationship with the love of my life and all that. Nah, we gotta. She know who she is. I don't wanna say names. I'm in a relationship with the love of my life and all that. You know what I'm saying? But she. Yo, this she shit cool. Is Ill, she a troublemaker. You know them bitches, light skin bitches be troublemakers, but I still love them. So, what makes them like your favorite? <laughs> Bitch, stop, stop mine. But look, who we'll makes somebody your favorite ex though? And we didn't end bad. It was just like a mutual agreement. Uh, we're, not, we're not compatible. Then maybe that's a good reason. Nigga, if you love somebody here, y'all break up. I don't care what nobody, no nigga say, but that shit hard. If you love still on parts, yeah. Nigga, if you take out on a date, you still want to Like imagine say you that's see true. Shorty wanted with the next man, bro. You can't do that. Yeah. Shit you gotta, I'm not gonna lie to you, it's like, so cool get with your ex, you gotta have boundaries. Cause either you're gonna get hurt, or I'm gonna get hurt. Uh, okay, I'm, I'm not trying to have that. Uh, okay. If I was cool with their mother, yes. Why? Pack it up. Because I got a good relationship with my mother, Ooh. and I love mothers. I sure do hope you get her number. Ooh. The girl? Hell no, her mama, she the freak. Shit. I mean, it all depends. This could be like the way they talk to you compared to like the new person you're talking to. Could be the dates y'all went on. Could be shit like that. Yeah. What are your favorite eggs? Um, if we never end up on bad terms, like you know, situations that you just know, like yo, it's not gonna work. That, that's my favorite. I only got one ex though, and she's my favorite. I love you, babe. I love you, bae. Got it. Yeah, y'all niggas be safe out there, bae. Y'all niggas playing around.